Five, four, three, two, one. Boom, I hope. No, 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 no clippy things. No clippy things, SJ. Come on, SJ. Um, yeah, so look Sorry. at the camera. The lights I'm, I'm are looking on. at the camera. Look at the camera. Yep. Look right into the I'm camera. I'm looking right at the camera. Okay, so people, um, it's Sunday. Ah, this... no, no, no. Oh, see, You've look, done it again. again. <laughs> see, this isn't scripted. This is really live. <laughs> this is real life. Real live life. So it's Sunday. I'm SJ. This is Mr. B. If you haven't been to uh, Sneaker Stream on Sunday before. And uh, yeah, so we uh, do Sneaker Stream on Sunday. We do. Yeah. We do. And normally we would give you a sneak peek of what we've got coming in the week. Um, and you would normally get to see <laughs> that shoe. And SJ might even have that shoe in hand. But we had a bit of a fail this week. So we did on Tuesday... Yes, this is the invisible shoe you cannot see. On Tuesday, there'll be a video going up with the the Medicom um, Dunk High Elite. Elites. And um, if we go here, this is what they look like on feet. Um, I haven't got a surgical stocking on. I haven't got a bandage on. I haven't got a flight sock on. Um, that took about 15 minutes to get that, sh like, my foot into this shoe. Let's just say I've got fat feet now, and, um, I found something I can't wear because I'm a little on the I I'm sorry, the, the picture actually looks even worse than it looked in real life. It, it was a, a comical 15 minutes it to, was. Uh, to put it lightly um we, we might put up on thursday we might put up some of the earlier attempts of me trying to get into the shoe um yeah so, i did get it on though in the end yeah you got it on as you can see as you can see and yeah no it, it, no it just doesn't look no. right on my it, foot it doesn't does it? no i mean if they've made the sock bit in a different color Maybe, but it really did look like when you buggered your ankle. What was it? What did I do? You, 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 uh, you, you, you twisted your ankle. Well, thank you. About, no swears. That, well, that's, that's not a swear. Okay. About four years ago. Yeah. And you, in your dunks, funnily enough. Yeah. And you, those dunks. In, in these dunks. In these dunks. In these actual in these dunks, dunks here. People, these dunks, people, if you things. can see that. And yes, I yeah. did buy you a surgical stocking that looked like that so maybe you were ahead of your time maybe um so apologies we can't show you that and um i think you're probably bored of seeing the white widow yeah and the converse um, lavender lavender we and you're probably also even though you've not <laughs> had a video for it yet people you're probably also bored of the um the what the af2s that i haven't done you know what we do have what do we have can we find them what what i've just remembered tell me what there's a jordan yeah oh yes, yes. Okay. um okay so so bear with us people okay. what I, we're gonna do is, i'll try is, find them um i'm gonna come back to the main boom yeah so we're looking for a jordan and it's it's a relative of a very, very, very popular Jordan. And... Right, I'm going to vanish behind lots of shoeboxes, I think. The question is, it's this one, isn't it? I think so. Right, okay, so as you can see, many, many shoeboxes. So let's get rid of those shoeboxes. I think it's that one. Shoebox there. No! no okay, case, that's a fail. The one at the that's a fail. Okay, so... so there's a pair of Jordans that I bought in Flight Club towards... This is like we're basically packing ourselves. Right, Yay. I've got them. I've got them. We got, got them. them. Right. right. So, so you take that and I'll put these back. Yeah. This is, as you can see, people, entirely unscripted. So um, everyone loves the leather on the shattered backboards. I can tell you that these are not the shattered backboards. Um, the shattered backboard. They are the reverse shattered backboard. 
And you haven't really seen these yet. Have I you? haven't, no, not properly. Right, so so get get your mitts on that. Look at that, people. And we will do a proper unboxing. We're not going to show everybody everything on these. Um, but I picked these up in Flight Club. I paid too much money for them. Um, as you, as do. you do in Flight Club. As you do in Flight Club. Predominantly, actually, the tax. Yeah. Which I'd forgotten about when I was looking at the prices. <laughs> Foolish. Um, the leather on the on the side panel here is in sale. It's lovely. It is. It's very tumbled, very soft. It is really soft, that. They're really nice. <laughs> it's like, these are so nice. These are from 2016, I'm just checking. Yeah, these are the 2016. But... Um, yep, they are from May to July. Because um, you can always see the date inside the shoes. I didn't realise yeah, that. Okay. Yeah, yeah, no, I'd never noticed that yes, before. Yes, it's in there. Um, super excited about these. Got these in flight though, as I said, and they are lovely. I've not laced them, as you can see. And we ha had actually done, we had actually planned to do a video um, with these and the satin shattered blackboards, but obviously I didn't get a pair. No, you didn't. So um, that's the reason why we haven't put a video out. But they're super nice. Yeah, I do like. We'll these do a, a proper lot. unboxing of those. Super wearable. We'll go with you know. Anything. anything to be honest jordan one goes with anything jordan like you know it's it's just such a classic pitch. sorry i'm just like yeah, waving a shoe waving a shoe at me yeah i know it's fine it is a okay. classic should i leave shape. it here yes. um should i leave it there no 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 okay. let's let's no, let's not uh, okay. let's not put it there okay. because i don't want people to get like i don't want, i want to do a proper video okay, on those okay, shoes okay, okay, okay. i want to lace them okay. up properly and all of that malarkey um yeah so Next week, there should be more to show you. Yeah, next week, uh, we've got some sneakers heading over from the US. We do. Slightly irritating because those sneakers have now dropped in the UK. Uh, and they're costing me a small fortune to ship from the US because somebody has big feet. And obviously, dunks yeah. are a big shoe. <clears throat> so they're very weighty. <clears throat> so they're costing as much as the actual shoe to ship from the US. Yeah, that makes no sense. I don't understand that. We've got to stop using this service. No, it's fine for me because I've only got little feet in there. Okay, okay, okay. So, so SJ. Um, and the fact you wanted two pairs rather than one. If it had been one, I could have coped with it, but two, two? Yeah, but, but what anyway. else have you got coming? What else have we got coming? We've got a pair of Nike Air Max coming. What, what'd you get? What'd you get? I got the red curry. Yeah? Yeah. And when was the last time you had Air Max? Uh, when I was about 13. Wow. <laughs> At Air Max 1. Air Max 1, yeah. When I was about 13. Yeah, because you had... Uh, I had 90, 90, 97. 97s. Yeah, yes. I, I remember them. Yes. Retro, vintage, silver. Way back. Way, way back. Way back when? In 97. In 97, yes. yeah. Yeah. Um, so, so, that, you know, it's, it's hard for us to do these streams without shoes to show you. But, but, but... It is that time of the week, SJ. Yeah. Where we have a little stroll through... The news. Which isn't really in the news. No, no, it's gone a bit Eurovision. Okay. And our American friends probably won't know what we're talking about there. Right. Anyway. So we'll, um, I need to then scare people with that image. No. And then <laughs> turn that image off. Boom. There we go. There's a much better image for the world to see. Grandpa, um, Mr. Bean is surgical shop. <laughs> there, that's, that's so wrong, SJ. So wrong. Um, so, tried many times to get these shoes last week. I actually had them in basket off the Converse. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, sorry, ooh, sorry, ooh. I just hit that. Um, yeah, so we didn't get, obviously. We didn't get. However. Yeah. Hang on, I'm just, no, I'm just double checking. Who, who, so, do you know someone who got these? Yeah, I do. A real do. person. A real got, person. A real person won these shoes, everybody. Or at hang least on, won the on, right on. to buy hang them. On, hang on, hang on, hang on. Come on. Hang on, hang on. Oh, you know sorry, what? Sorry, I did a lot of. You know what we've forgotten Treated to bring up what, for, for the what, people? What did we forget to bring up for the people? The Panini World oh Cup football God. stickers. I'll tell you what we're going to do next week, everybody, on the stream. Um, we're going to deviate slightly from the sneaker theme. And we're going to we're gonna open Panini World Cup football stickers with each other. Okay, so Kim, okay. Kim TV. Kim TV. Who I follow with on follow with who i follow on twitter mm -hmm. and we uh swap 
the odd sneaker treat. Yep. She picked them up. She, she picked them up. She did. Yeah. Look, she pictures and everything. Um, I did ask if she was going to wear them. Mm-hmm. There we go. See, see. Oh, nice. And uh, and is, she, is Kim going to wear them? She said. Um, I asked her if she liked them. She said, I do. Not sure if I'll wear them anytime soon. They're just kind of nice to look at. There you go. They are kind of nice to look at. I saw a picture of somebody, I think, wearing these with orange socks. They looked so cool. Yeah, no, they, I mean, they are nice. I didn't so really cool. like the Converse to begin with, but, you know. Apparently that sole yeah, is no. thicker than normal. It's yeah, no. better construction. So, so that was that. Um... Then we have coming out this week this Ooh. Fast Break. I think it's Fast Break. Fast Break 2. Um, it is a colorway, I think, from 82. It's super nice. Um, it's coming out definitely in the US this week. It's definitely in the sneakers app. I've not seen it in the UK. I'm slightly concerned that it won't come out in the UK because it's converse and they don't normally sell converse on the nike site in the uk but have you checked converse.co.uk i haven't you know maybe you should um, because but i love this green um 84 actually um it was apparently there was a i don't know the guy's name so i'm not really into basketball sorry um but what? there's to commemorate a foul you're the next guy yeah, but not really. Like, I, I don't follow. I couldn't give you the, a potted history of the okay, Knicks right now right. in the same way that I could for Aston Villa. <laughs> it's, a ten, it's a tense time in this house. At the it's moment. very tense. Um, uh, soccer for all you US. Yeah, guys soccer for out the world. There. Soccer for the world. Yeah. Um, okay, so. Yeah, super nice shoe. Super, super, super nice. I can see you wearing these a lot. If. I if get them. you get them um, look very nice of your new jumper your wouldn't... new very vintage jumper this is from 1994 I picked it up in a, in more or less a thrift shop there you go yeah I was quite pleased with it you were very pleased like, oh, look at that it's vintage <laughs> anyway um, so from one converse to another um, Tyler the creator obviously the um, Fleur one stars These are, there's another batch dropping I really like the. I know you like the Spider Man colours. Yeah, and one? I do as well. Which one are you feeling? Oddly. Yeah. I sang about me and pale pink at the moment. I like that pink and golden. Oh, okay. That wasn't what I was expecting no, you to say. I, so, so this I one. I really like this them. one that we're yeah. going to show on screen now. Yeah. When are these dropping? Um, I think these are dropping this week, apparently. Mm, I really like those a lot. Um, They're super nice. I've seen I've seen the first batch. It sounds weird. So in the flesh in Flight Club, and that's what changed. From, like I've been intrigued by them. You're not a big Converse wearer. Are you? I'm not. I'm not. But there's something. This is going to sound weird. There's something about that flower, that flower shape. I just think it. There's just something a little bit. Mm, like, the alien like. It's cool. You know what it reminds me of. What. Della Soul. Vaguely, but it reminds me of that weird alien type program that used to be on Sunday oh. nights and they canned it after one season. Invasion. Invasion, yes. It ha- they have a touch of invasion. If the anybody thing else, in the water. If anybody else out there watched Invasion. Sorry, I don't know why I'm know, doing this. Because I think we must have been the only people that were watching well, obviously, it. Obviously, yeah. Um, it was a great yeah. show. Yeah. Um, <laughs> But they do not that great, obviously. Yeah, that, that, that's true. That's true. Um, okay, so then we're moving through to the next piece of news, and it is the there's finally a release date for the Air Jordan One Rebel, but in that Chicago colorway. Yeah. Um, are these women's so, only, uh, or are they coming in women's bigfoot sizes? That I couldn't say. I'd, I'd need to look on the Nike site for sure. Okay. Um, obviously, these came from the uh, that. You know, obviously that Rebel is that twisted um, interpretation of the Jordan 1. Um, this is the Chicago colorway. Uh, allegedly out on May 19th in the US. That's the same day as the... Um, the, ho- the homage. The, what, the, the homage to home? Yes, that's the one. Homage. 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 Like, like, homage. Re- really, like from really, homage. Homage. Like really get your mouth around it. Homage. 
yeah, yeah. whatever. Um, anyway, so is. so I, I just really like this shoe. I um, do. It's a um, Jordan has 1. Has that got a zip down the side? It has. So because they, otherwise I was going to say me trying to get you never these get... on in the morning in a rush for no. a train. It ain't happening, dude. So we've got that. But then I was sort of on, I think this is, I don't know. Uh, so then I had a quick look on the Nike site. What did I find? I found another one which is coming out on the 19th, and it is the top three. So effectively, it's the Chicago, it's the Game Royal, and the Black Toe all combined in one. Yeah. Which, if you look at these, like, oh my god. These are, so these nice. are women's, right? Yeah, oh, yeah, it's the Rebel. Yeah. So nice. So, so nice. Yeah, but I'm not going to be able to get them. No, but you can still lust after them and go, so nice. These are so nice. Anyway, yes, they're so nice, SJ. Yeah, they're super nice. Um, anyway. Super, super nice. We won't get them, but no. I can think. I, I love the twistedness of, of the, the Rebel. I just think it didn't have to do in much to the, the that, that Jordan 1 silhouette. But they just added a twist to it. Yeah, literally. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I didn't even mean to do that. You yeah, see? Right. I d anyway. Um, okay, so the next story really, so next story, the next piece of news really is um, there was something, so you probably all know that we got the, the deconstructed blazers and dunks. Um, we both got them. Mm-hmm. And I think if you, when we first highlighted these deconstructed, I think the first thing you said is, why don't they do a high version of this? It's like Nike SB were listening. Because. How beautiful is this? They are doing shoe? some kind of high. It's not Ooh. completely Ooh. deconstructed. Ooh. 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 Although it's Ooh. just Pinterest. Ooh. Yeah, no one's on Pinterest, no. but I still get alerts. How um, beautiful is this shoe? Uh, let's look. So I'm on the Flat Spot website at the moment. But because it's Flat Spot, they don't start in my size. No. But that means we could probably track them down elsewhere. Oh, super nice. So clean. Super nice. So clean. Like, I really like these a lot. Like, look these pictures. I don't know whether these are stock pictures or whether these are Flat Spot pictures. Whatever they are, whoever's done them, they're selling them to me. They've they've done them really well. Mm. Like, let's just look at the top. Yeah. Of, like, it's a blazer. We all know it's a blazer. You know the interesting thing though with what? these compared to the other deconstructed mm -hmm. is that they haven't gone, or not obviously in these pictures, with that really nice sort of coppery golden um, embroidery. No. For Nike, which makes me wonder. So, flat spot are calling them deconstructed, but you know what they really look like? Do you remember, many, many moons ago, you had a black <laughs> pair? I did have a black pair, which I totally trashed. And they look so similar. They do, and the tongue is finished, whereas yeah. on the deconstructed, the tongue isn't. So, I don't and know. And that's padded. That's super padded. That's not deconstructed. So, that's what they're saying. Um, there's obviously a bunch of canvas deconstructed shoes now as well they've deconstructed the Janoski as well they have but no on closer inspection that is not deconstructed however they're still super nice super nice super nice, super nice. and I loved my black ones I, I totally trashed them you did as I normally do these things right so just wanted to flash this up Atmos we love Nike out next week Possibly tomorrow in the UK. Possibly not. Um, if you're in the UK, please don't buy these. Please allow me to buy them. Please, nobody buy these. Just let me buy them. Nobody. Yeah? yeah? Oh, is that a good deal? I think that's a good deal, yeah? You all got the curries. That's fine. You can have them. I want these. Are we all good with that? Thank you. <laughs> Shall we move on? Okay. Do you like these? I do. I, you don't like the blue leather, do there's you? There's something about the blue that... What, on the mudguard? Yeah, I don't know what it is about the blue. It may be because of the way that they've pictured the blue against the blue mm -hmm. that it just doesn't work for me. It, it's possible. It, I am I think it's a shoe that I would need to see. But blue and grey and white, you know, they should totally match. I think it is just the fact that it's 
they've used a blue background mm-hmm. and it doesn't show off yep. the shoe in its best light. Yeah, I think, in my opinion. I think you might be right. I think um I think the other thing is the Air Max ninety, which is the red version. Yeah. I wouldn't normally wear an Air Max ninety, but I th- Oddly, the Air Max ninety it's in the, the red, red yeah. looks more retro than that shoe. Yeah. If that makes any sense. It does, and I actually like I love these. I wish they'd made these in red and the others in blue. Agree. Because I think the red box print on the 90s. So I'm, we'll see. We'll see what I get tomorrow. If you get anything at all. Nobody buy them, please, please, <laughs> please. Just saying that again. Uh, so, um, but that brings me then, you know, Air Max, all of that. Nike are running that their competition again where we all get to vote on people's designs. And I... I voted once this week. I think you can vote once a day. Um, and I, I didn't like any of the London ones. I was like, oh, really? Yeah, no. So bad. But first of all, I spotted this, um, the one one of the ones from Seoul from a guy called June o- o Park, um, Air Max 98. So quite, you know, 98, always a good year for us. Um but the thing I liked about these is he he's using he's inspired by the Seoul subway and nobody's going to see this but this tattoo is inspired by subways uh, and metro, metro systems amongst other things so I really really like this but the one that really jumped out at me the most and I think it was because it's in black and white was one from Yuta Takuman, um, and he's in Tokyo, and he's designed something inspired. He's called it Tokyo Maze, and he is inspired by um, again their subway and their trains. And I think the interesting thing as well is the laces on these. He's actually using the colours of the lines. Yeah, and and I like that shape. Yeah, and you've got the flashes of red, which yeah. just. Uh, yeah, that's a nice shoe. A... I I actually prefer, I think. Yeah. If you go back. So we're gonna go back to the to the to the that. Soul no, one? no, no. But scroll down, scroll down. That one. Oh, the cultural city yeah. of Tokyo from from wood. Yeah. Um. That's really cool. Max ninety five. That's a cool shoe. It's it's an interesting design. Well, well, don't forget to vote, people. Hi. Uh, <laughs> I think. Give me some shoes. Shoes. What shoes? shoes. What shoes? What shoes would you like? <laughs> uh, um, yeah. Uh, so, so. If you've just joined, we have. What, what have we shown? We we have shown these. We've shown these. Um, we've shown. Um, we show the fact. We explained why we weren't showing these. We'll kill that again. That's a terrible. Nobody wants. No to see one that. wants to see that. Um, but everyone wants to see these. And the reason why I encourage everyone to vote is because obviously the Sean w- Wotherspoons yes. came out of this competition last year, I think. And it was just amazing. Yeah, it's, it's it's so nice. It's so nice. So nice. And uh, have we got anything <laughs> else on the news? Um, we have one other thing. And we really wanted to discuss this with everybody out there. Yeah. Um, so it's <laughs> the acronym VaporMax um, Collab. In the, I don't even know what they're call, calling that colorway. And let, let's get to the shoe. It's it's the thirsty band. Thirsty band. It's, it's a mop. Thirsty band. Now we don't normally do vapor. This isn't the one. Yeah, it is. No, this isn't the one you wanted, was it? Yeah, that's the one that's releasing tomorrow. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. Now there was one which had the the, the vapor max. So, so the air units were were already printed on. So they took the, uh, it was in black and vault, vault being a yellowy color. Anyway, so we want to know, like, we don't normally wear Vapor Max. No. And... There's there's something about this shoe that I kind of, I'm kind of intrigued by it. I mean, it's not something that I'd normally wear. And as I said to Mr. B yesterday, if we were still in, if we were in America and I was walking the dog 10K a day, Mm-hmm. as opposed to uh, me not walking the dog as much, I would buy these because I would see me just slipping these on and wearing them. I But 
I'm kind of intrigued by them, but they're super pricey. They are. They're like two hundred and ten pounds in the UK, which is two hundred and. Well, in the US, obviously before tax, it's to their two hundred and twenty-five dollars. So if you're you in know, California, at ten percent. Yeah, that's a lot of dollar for your that's Nike. A lot of dollar. But they're quite nice. I want to know, like, does what? anybody out there who watches us, does anybody actually have a, a pair of Vapor Max? I'm kind of in because you know I'm all about the Epic React. I'm, yeah, I'm intrigued by that. Like I think if you're gonna go for the Vapor Max, I think you need to go for a dark color. Like I quite liked the um, the off white mm -hmm. black Vapor yeah. Max, and I went in for those and obviously didn't get them. Um, but yeah, I I, don't the, I like this pattern and I like the flashes of that orange. Mm -hmm. I'm just not sure after your your dunk high sock experience whether I would consider them to be similar and then I will look like an old granny in my surgical sock slipper shoe type thing. So I'm going to say that you wouldn't and I'm going to say because these <laughs> I wish I had a pair. They're like $225. They're so it's much crazy money. Crazy money. So much money. I don't think you'll look like an old lady in these. Um I think you'll be able to get these on easily because the the the, the bit around the foot. Yeah, it's not as weirdly shaped as that, it is yeah. on the <laughs> on the bridge of your foot. On, yeah, whatever Maybe. it is. is yeah, it, is that what you call I don't know. it? But yeah, I don't know. They're they're kind of interesting. Yeah, like please let us know because ah. Uh, See, that's a nice colorway. That is a super nice colorway. It's not the colorway. It's the air units. I can't get past them. Do you them. know what? If those air units were in black, they would have looked much better. Maybe it's a side-on profile. Like, like maybe they just don't picture well. They kind of look like... Um, they look like soccer boots. Yeah, I was going to say that, but they also look like reptile feet. Reptile feet. <laughs> um, I'm thinking of like... Reptile feet. Right, I'm going to show my age here now. Really? They look like they remind me. What of do like, they look like? They Come remind on. me of. Tell 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 the people what do they, they look like? They remind me of Sly from Thundercats. Sly from Thundercats. Yes. Um, if anybody out there knows who <laughs> Sly from Thundercats is, leave us a comment or leave us a comment in the chat because I think you might be the only person in the world. Who I knows. love Thundercats. Have you broken the chair again? I think I might have broken the chair again. SJ. Um, yeah. So, so that was that. Um, but uh, yeah, bring it back, bring it back. You ready to come back? Yep. Boom. So another thing we wanted to discuss was yep. the uh, the curry pack that launched this week. Mm -hmm. uh, the first pair launched on the 10th, which was the OG colorway that launched on the 10th. Yep, the dark curry. The dark curry, and then obviously the red curry and the yellow green curry launched green. yesterday so um so we logged on to sneakers app both of us at the same time mr b went for the red for me i went for the red for me he got them i was told i didn't get them but then they were all in stock in all sizes so what's all that about does that mean Nike would just say, no, I can't buy a pair of shoes? Yeah. That's kind of how it felt. Because until, in fact, let's look now. You know, even these, our friends, yeah. the East London Edit, they said to me, they're back there in stock. What are you on about, basically? And I'm like, well, I got the email that, or the, the, yep. the app very yep. clearly told me I didn't have. There we go, no. Are they back in stock? They're not in stock in my size now, when when they were. But look, look at that, people. You can still buy them in most sizes. Yeah. So what is all that about, Nike? What is all that about? You you stopping me from spending my money on sneakers? They wanted me to buy them for you. I I. Well, you them owe up. me. Let's put it that way. You owe me, dude. <laughs> I was like Nike. I've got to buy these, and I, so I like I. I phoned up Nike and went, you can't let that SJ, she can't, she's not allowed to buy him. And and then like, they were like, yeah, sure, Mr. B, we'll, we'll do that for you. Cause you're like really important and stuff. 
this this did not happen. Obviously this didn't happen. <laughs> but but yeah, that makes me, you know, <laughs> I think we all know about my little whinges over raffles, etc. But yeah. but that sort of thing makes me a little bit unsure as to how these systems are working in the back end and whether there uh, there is favoritism or whether they're actually, you know, I don't know. It's like not quite right. It's just not right. Somebody would say. It's just not right. It's just not right. Right. Um, so I think I think now that you've had your little rant. What is on your feet? Well, for me this week, it, it's not rained that much in the UK, and so I've been creating a bit of a rotation of old shoes. <laughs> you have. Boom. Whoa! I need my sunny. Look at that. So that is what I've had on. I've worn these to work this week. You had those on a Friday when you came to meet me. Yep. These were. I was uh, like, "Woo! Hello, dog. Oh, look, hello, sneakers." So let me get the other one off for you, so you can have a look at it. So these are the Della Souls. Obviously, the low, so they're reissue um, versus the high. Um, you have the high as well, though. Uh, not the high not, in this colorway. Oh, no. Um, so these were. These are from 2014. Uh, they were made sort of November to January 2015, but I think I picked them up in 2014. They are super nice. Um, they're the Della Souls. The one thing I thought was really interesting about them, which I hadn't noticed at the time. No, well, I hadn't. What, this? Well, that there. Right, so I'm going to just read you the, the, the colour. So, hang on. The, the colourway. Okay, go on then. Right, so if you look, the colourway is Safari. So that's the Safari bit around the mudguard here. Yeah. Yeah. Altitude green, yeah. Baroque brown, and what's that word? Jedi. Jedi. Yeah. They've used Jedi. I'd never noticed. <laughs> I was just like, oh my god, these shoes have got a Jedi color. <laughs> so yeah, I got very very excited about that when I looked at those earlier. Child. Um, but yeah, they're a super nice shoe. The thing I like about them a lot. I don't think. Anybody could prize these out of Mr. No, B's hands. These are never, ever leaving my hands. Um, or your feet. Or my feet. Um, the thing I really like about them is, A, the materials are really tough. They might not be the best materials in the world. It might not be the best suede. I don't know. The suede isn't but, that bad. It's I had the, never noticed. They've not creased, really. Well, you haven't worn them that much. Oh, a little bit. Bit, but but you... what I hadn't noticed before is that all of this is like a vinyl. Yeah, that's all vinyl. Yeah, it's well um, nice. That's the album cover. I knew it was the album cover, but I hadn't appreciated the the material that. Maybe I'll used. dig out the white ones this week if it doesn't rain. Oh, I'm presenting. No, I can't do that. Um, <laughs> so so that's what I've had on my feet. I really love these shoes. Uh, they are epic. Hardly worn. They're obviously not dead stock. Um, but pretty good quality. Yeah. Pretty good quality. Oops, sorry. Oh, <laughs> sorry there, Ram. We are back bashing the mic microphone away. So we're going to put those there. So SJ, what's on your feet? Well, again, because it hasn't really rained this week, apart from yesterday, I jinxed the weather by saying I was going to put my duck boots away. Then of course it absolutely chucked it down. Yep. So, so I've been wearing. Um, what's on your foot? Various vans, including these, which I think I've shown you before. Uh, these are last year's Vans Kendra Dandy collab in the authentic, um, in the authentic, you know, there you go, pretty clean. Yeah. So who's Kendra Dandry? Oh, here we go again. I knew you were going to ask me that again and I haven't checked. Okay. Okay. Um, the thing I like about these, A, I like, so you can't beat a polka dot on a shoe, but it's someone eating an ice cream. Yeah, and I've eaten a lot of ice cream this yeah. week, so they they kind of felt quite fitting. I think right, so we'll give these a clean up. Um, it's around the sole and the the midsole and yeah, stuff. Yeah, somebody did catch my heel as I was coming up the tube on Friday, which kind of annoyed me. I, I the other shoe, would actually. recommend do not wear these all the time. No, I'm not. Don't I'm not. beat them I'm up not. because they're so nice. I'm not. They're so nice. So everyone, um, Ram out there. Um, Thanks for joining us in the chat. Thank Sorry you. that we've not been so um, great in the chat today. Uh, God, that was face. Put those down there. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, this is this is professional here, everyone. We're very, very <laughs> professional at what, at what we do on Sunday nights. Uh, <laughs> so that was that. 
Um, I think next week, so on Tuesday, you'll see the actual unboxing of the that, that Medicom Dunk High Elite. And your initial opinion. Yeah, which you. I'm pretty honest. Yeah, pretty I'm, honest. I'm pretty yeah. honest. Um, hopefully, if your Air Max red curries arrive, um, we will get an unboxing of those out. I am also toying with the idea... <laughs> Not for you, Ram. Sorry. <laughs> You're also toying with the idea of what? Of what? Um, I'm toying with the idea of putting together like a little monthly kind of compilation of all the on feet that we do. Sorry, the dogs. On with the a moon. little um, intro and outro of us, like okay. just like, or maybe we might do voiceover through it. Okay. Um, I've already put together like the actual because we we do like four on feet a month. Um. And we've also got coming this week, again, depending on delivery, your AF2s. Yep, which are the West Coast yeah. of the Rivals Pack, um, mm -hmm. allegedly inspired by Tupac, uh, although Nike SB claim not, um, mm. so slightly controversial there. Um, so hopefully they will arrive. So I'm hoping that everyone will, you know, there'll be plenty of content for everybody all this week and if you've not subscribed by now and you have made it this far on the stream <laughs> well done um and you're not a subscriber thank you so much um if you want to subscribe that really help it's just about here i think probably um if you want to join the notification crew notification crew notifications notification crew mate, mate isn't it? Geezer, isn't it? Isn't um it? just slap the old bell like that uh oh made the table wobble there and if you're watching this on catch up and I, you haven't made it this far. <laughs> and you're thinking, what the hell is what it? What is going on? Uh, what is going we do on? this every Sunday. And yeah, that th we've got one box <laughs> there as well. Put that away. Don't, don't <laughs> put that away. Um, so we do this every Sunday. And we stream from... We stream is, from 8 p.m. UK time, which is 12 o'clock on the Pacific Coast, 3 p.m. on the East Coast. And we upload and in, on Tuesdays and Thursdays. And I think in Dubai... That must be about midnight. I would need to check. Yeah, but I think that is. So, um, just want to say... Thank you to everybody that tuned in. Thank you to all our new subscribers. Leave us a comment. Let us know your thoughts on those Vapor Max. And uh, see you next week. See you next week, people. Bye. Bye.